Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have been having a look in Primark and I have found these things. They are makeup kits and they are for Halloween. I actually first saw these on Primark's Instagram and today we're going to try them out. This is called Kiss of Death. This is half skeleton, half plain. And I also saw a video on their Instagram just in case I get stuck on how to do this which I hardly doubt I would because it's quite simple but we're gonna see how it goes and we're gonna test this out this is the only one that I could find unfortunately I couldn't find any of the other ones I know it's about three of these this was eight pound from Primark and it's in their like makeup Halloween section so I actually couldn't find this anywhere else but this is gonna be really fun and let's get started this includes black face paint white face paint glitter face gems i'm gonna zoom you in so you guys can see and so i can see i'm gonna use everything that's in here i also do have some brushes and some black eyeshadow as well because i saw on the instagram um video that they were using black eyeshadow to kind of do like the lines and stuff right let's open this baby up so if we just take so i'm going to start off with white face paint oh this is quite cool actually because it's like in you know, a little thing so i'm just going to dip my this sponge that i got in there and white face paint just swirl it in dab it on and see how this goes i mean i'm only going to use what they've given me i look like i'm making myself a beard like santa i've never really done halloween face makeup on myself you think i would with the, like the makeup tutorials that i do but i don't think i've ever really done like a skull or anything i've never really dressed up for halloween either because it's on my birthday <laughs> so i don't ever think about going out for halloween or anything or trick or treat i've never been trick or treating either i'm so jealous about anyone who's gone trick or treating i mean i want to see what it's like i mean if it's not that great then fair enough but i don't know how great it is because i've never been <laughs> so now i've got to get to the black so i've got the black face paint and then we get the sponge again this face paint is actually quite good i mean it looks really patchy in the in the in here but i still think it's quite decent like if i lay it this properly once i finish this so i go on top of my lid i'm just going to see if i can just blend that out and just soften that black around the edges Okay, I think they used black paint for the cheeks. Someone's supposed to do this. This is really hard. I mean, I know a lot of people have done this before, but using this, it just looks a bit like a mess, really. Do I want like a skull yet? <laughs> Now I can understand why they made sponges round because this is really hard. And now I need to put some lines on my lips. So I'm just going to use this angled brush again. I'm going to get some black eyeshadow again. Tap that off and then I'm going to do some lines. I mean, I guess I am kind of cheating because I'm supposed to be using a sponge. I feel like this doesn't look right because it's not in the right place or it needs to be out a little bit, more like here. So this is the normal body glue that I use. This is from Amazon. It shows on the thing, put it on the top of your eyelid. So they're like, oh God, look, it's already coming off the paint. At least it's only on one eye, so it's not too bad. I'm just gonna open this box up and let this glitter fall where it wants to fall make my eyes sticky now okay so we're now going to add some gems so they say to on the diagram it shows you where to put the exact gem so it's saying just put them in between your eyebrows on top of your eye under your eye and on your lips the heart is sticky so this is all sticky i don't have to use anything so this heart goes in the middle of my face i guess the good thing about this is guys can do this as well because if they like they can be like a glittery skull i think that'd be quite cool Right, we've put all the gems on. I think it looks pretty cool when I close my mouth like this. Right, all the teeth. It does actually look pretty cool. What I would say is that this face paint is crap. <laughs> I love this idea though. I think it's quite nice. Primark, this is actually really good. I would not recommend putting the glitter on for logo. guys. Saying that, they actually do have a photo. This is actually a photo. Obviously, it's photoshopped and it looks so much better on her because 
Photoshop. Right, she's using this Rina Fred lipstick. I highly doubt it's this. This is what I, it was in the kit. So I'm gonna try this on my lips and see how it goes. I'm all done. Okay, I actually really like this lipstick. Like this is Primark lipstick. It's actually really good. That's actually crazy. So I'm not sure how well this actually turned out, but I think it looks all right. I thought it was gonna look worse than this. So overall verdict, I'd probably give this Eight out of ten? Nah, it's too high. Probably gives out a six out of ten. This lipstick is like a nine out of ten. It's really, really good. But the glitter was pretty really crap, and the face paint is quite crap. But everything else is really good. Like everything stayed on. But I think if you're going to use these gems and actually like talk with them, I recommend putting proper like body glue on it so i really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what you guys are going for as for halloween and if you guys want to try this out these are from primark eight pounds and i actually got it on the right side so thank you guys so so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye guys